I installed the iOS 16 beta 2 on my iPhone 13 Pro and I don't have to roll back. I am using and waiting for the public release. The iOS 16 beta 2 adds new features and makes the firmware more stable. Let's start with the lock screen. Apple added the option to customize your wallpaper. Now you can apply different color schemes to your own photo. If you go to the settings, you have a choice. Apply the change to your entire system or leave the color you want only for the lock screen. If you set the planet earth team as your lock screen image you will have a green indicator on your screen that will show your location now you can quickly delete unnecessary layers simply by swiping the lock screen upwards the messages app has been upgraded with a new filter function known contacts identifying numbers unread messages this make it more convenient to distinguish incoming messages to enable this function you need to go to the message settings and enable message filtering when you take a screenshot, we are given several options to choose from. It can be saved in a photo, as a quick note, or put in the application files. The new video player. When playing video with the built-in iOS player, it is now possible to easily rewind a slide of any parts of the screen with the use of the haptic mechanism. So it's more convenient to control the accuracy of scrolling. In the new iOS 16 and macOS Ventura, Apple has developed a system of capture bypass. If a website uses the Cloudflare or Fastly anti-spam system, you'll no longer need to solve puzzles. And Apple system will let the service know that you're a real person and will let you through without using captures. We are waiting for Apple to do the same for the recapture from Google. In iOS 16 beta 2, Apple has greatly optimized the speed of spotlight search. Now the search for files on your smartphone or any phrase on the internet is lightning fast. If you've used Spotlight often, I'm sure you'll be delighted. Rumor has it that iOS 16 Beta 3 will add a feature to recognize fake AirPods headphones. The first time you connect, the system will display a notice that you are not the original headphones owner, but a fake. I wonder if it will be the possible to use such headphones in the future? After all, someone buys such headphones on purpose because they are much cheaper. But you know, life is too short to listen to cheap headphones. I think that's an advertising slogan by Beats by Dr. Dre, which also belongs to Apple. That's all guys. If you want to install iOS 16 beta 2, just look at our previous video. We have a step-by-step -step instruction. Link in description. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.